this is my like fifth attempt at doing this video. True story. Hello everybody, I hope you guys are doing okay. Um, I hope that my absence for a few months did not make you run away from this channel. And my deepest apologies if it did. And, um, I did make a song. And I did post it on YouTube, like, maybe a few days to a week ago. But to be on, but to be honest, that's really the only activity I've done on my YouTube, on my YouTube channel in, like, three months. But, um... But, I am going to start making videos ten times more, you know, a hundred times more often than I was before. That's probably making it over dramatic. And I probably need to go back to, you know, never mind. Um, sorry if the table was shaking, that was me stretching. Um... Anyway, let's talk a little bit about my absence, my three-month absence. So, here is the honest, um, here, here's the honest truth. I have been absent because, of course, school has been back in session. Not only that, but really it's more because God, God has been dealing with me a lot lately. And, um... I just want to say that he has helped me so much in this walk with him. And guys, guys, let me say something. It hasn't been easy. It hasn't been easy. Not one bit. But God's love, his mercy, his endurance, his lovingness, his patience has, has pulled me through. And I'm going to be making videos a lot more often. So, um, yeah. As you can probably tell by the title, today I will be making a video about, um, people, basically. People and their intelligence and people in their own brains and how they think that they're so much better than God. And this is really just a reminder to stay at your level. Stay humble. Um... Don't get all prideful. Don't let your head blow up so big. And, um... And I also wanted to say a few words of encouragement before I dug really deep into the actual topic of the video. So, yeah. First of all, I just want to say that I haven't let haters get in my way. And I'm done doing that. I'm done arguing with haters. I'm done doing all of that. You know, I'm very done. I'm not going to argue with scriptures with them anymore. I'm not going to, I'm, I'm not going to argue. And that's just a waste of time. Don't do it. Don't, don't fall into the devil's traps. He wants you to argue. He wants you to debate with people. Don't do it. Because let me tell you something, it's not worth it. And, um, that will definitely get you hurt in the end. And we don't, you know. So, yeah. Just take it like this. You can't see haters with your love glasses on. So, guys, that's just really the best way to take it. So, um... Anyway, let's get on with the video now. That's just words of encouragement. You may not have friends. You may not have people there to support you. But just remember that God is always, he's always there to support you. No matter who or what comes, you know, against you. Let's get in, let's get into, let, let's get into the actual video now. I think you've been waiting long enough. So, um... You know, I see a bunch of people making books about the Bible, about Jesus, what they know. Um, and yes, I am an author, if you guys don't know that. I am an author, and if you don't know that, you, you definitely need to head over to my Facebook page, Mary Williams, to check that out. 
because I have made two books in a cheer in a series called Beginning Now, Beginning of Forgiveness and Beginning of Hardship. I've created and posted those two books, but I didn't put my Bible knowledge in there. What I know and criticizing you for what you guys don't know and people do that. P authors actually have the nerve to sit there. And I'm sorry if you hear that. That's my dog. Um, in there. Um, but I just want to say that those people and people who are writing commentaries and people who sit here and argue about the Bible thinking they know everything, people who go out there and street preach in pride and people who have all of this money and has just let it go into their head and people who, all of these people who claim to be a Christian. I have a message for people like that. You have let your head get big. That's my dog. He's barking now. What a perfect time to bark, right? But you have let your head get big. You have let the devil get into your mind. You have let him made you make you higher than what you are. You need to get down to your level. Your level is a human being made by God. God made you. You're not going to be above God no matter how hard you st try to stop being prideful. Be humble. God isn't going to let prideful people into the kingdom of heaven. You have to be humble. You have to get down to your level. And um, I just want to say, you know, it isn't necessary to read those books about the Bible commentaries, um, authors who have made Bibles just... I mean, authors who have made books about the Bible, books about, you know, Christian things and deceiving people, you know, they can't deceive people. Like Joel Osteen, look at him. He's made books. I think Joyce Myers made books. I'm not sure. And they're both wolves in sheep's clothing. Take it up to the Lord if you want to know something. He will not make your head big. Um... You know, he can teach you things. God will give you the knowledge that he needs. And even the Bible says that God will give you knowledge. You don't need to get knowledge from men and women. You need to get knowledge from Jesus Christ. He will give you all of the knowledge you need. And people who go on like, you know, they're just prideful. And you don't need to listen to prideful people. That's the last thing you need to do. Yes, I'm an author, but I don't make books and stuff like that. You know, people who make a bunch of books and stuff and people look up to them and admire them, it, it really gives them a big head. And like I said, I'm an author, but I don't. I don't know how to say it. I don't make books about, like, the Bible and my walk and stuff. I. I make books trying to encourage people. You know, they're fictional stories. They're not about me. They're not debates about the Bible. They're fictional stories. And right now, the two books I've made are about a girl named Olivia. But, you know, they're not... They're fictional, fictional stories. But they, they're really there to give you a lesson about your life and your walk with Jesus. But a lot of people don't make books like that. They make the books just to get money. And, you know, fame and money and stuff makes people prideful. And I just want to say that it's extremely easy to get into a level of pride when you feel higher than what you really are. And um, you really need to stay on your level. And this isn't a hate video. This isn't a video coming against any specific people. This is just a vi- my dog is going crazy now. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm really sorry. Um, I'm sorry if you hear that. Um, anyway, I better go ahead and finish this video but before he throws a temper tantrum. 
So, hopefully this you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I'm sorry about this dog. Um, you know, he's the best dog ever, but... Oh, I, I was about to show him, but... He walked out. Um, but guys, just remember to stay down to your level. And remember that God is always in control. And remember the words of encouragement I said, put your love glasses on. Don't worry about the haters, the people that hate you. And don't worry about if you have friends or not. Um, my dog is going crazy. But um, God bless you all. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to this channel. Like this video and comment if you want to. And even share if you want to. But I really don't care about all those things. I just hope that this video helped you. And, um, before this video gets any longer, God bless you all, and bye-bye. I will see you on my next video.